Good morning, boys and daddy. Today is Monday, March 8th, 2010. Two days until Gideon's seventh birthday, which is super fun. This morning, I need to run out and get some medicine from a drugstore across the river. It shouldn't take me very long. I will be back, and then I'm going to be feeling a lot better, and I'll be able to get a lot more things done, which will be nice. Today, I want us to focus on trying to be cheerful and about being hospitable to each other. Remember hospitality, not loneliness. And part of not being lonely is having a good kind attitude in actions and words towards each other whenever we're just around the house today. So if you are about to say something mean or disrespectful or disobedient, keep it to yourself. And if you can, why don't you try saying something kind instead? We're all home today, so we have a lot that we can get done. One of us might need to go and help Aunt Jo out for a little while because um, she hasn't been feeling well still, and I think she has to have surgery later on this week. Um, tomorrow is garbage day, which means that anything in this house that we can throw away, we need to gather up today, and we are going to make sure that it all gets out to the curb. Also, just in case we're getting any new toys on Wednesday because it's going to be Gideon's birthday, we want to go through a lot of our toys. We want to pack up some stuff we haven't been playing with a lot lately and put it in the attic. We might also want to um, start thinking about the outside toys, how we're going to organize them, where we're going to keep them. And mommy still really needs to work on laundry today, and I also need to work on some cooking today. And I got a new cookbook in the mail, and so I'd like to be able to try baking some things. So we'll see how that goes. Okay, so I want to say something every single day that I like about each one of you. Teddy, you are driving me crazy, but you still have the very nicest smile and nicest heart. You are working so hard on walking, and I am very proud of you for that. Aiden, you are so good about being kind most of the time and you've been doing pretty well with self-control. You still need to work on that, but you've been showing a lot of restraint even whenever you're angry. And Gideon, I really like how you have been helping Max Poloni at church the last two Sundays about being his friend, being hospitable, and helping him to not be lonely whenever he comes to church. You are actually already using that character quality of hospitality, so that is very nice. And David, I like you because you like me, and you are handsome, although we need to cut your hair, and because you're just very nice. Okay, prayer for the day. Ready? God, who art our dwelling place in all generations, look with favor upon the homes of our land, enfold husbands and wives, parents and children in the bonds of your pure love, and bless our homes that it may be bless our home that it may be a shelter for the defenseless, a bulwark for the tempted, a resting place for the weary, and a foretaste of our eternal home in thee, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Great. See you on the battlefield.